Now, with these caveats, uh, let me turn to Sri Lanka's trade policy. As all of you know, we had a draconian control regime until 77. But most important point is that during that regime, quantitative restrictions, direct licensing and import prohibition were the dominant policy instrument used. Tariff was there, tariffs were basically dormant. What is the difference between tariff and quantitative restriction? Quantitative restriction sever the link between the given country and the global markets. Therefore, importers are naturally turned out to be French seekers. They have limited amount of available import quota. They price them exorbitantly. That's what happened during the period before 70.